Hey, Ronnie. Hey. 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 My voice is changing again. Hey, Lou. It's about time. <laughs> hey, you know, one of the things amongst many that we have in common, you and I, is we're both fathers. Yes. Uh, I have three kids. You have two. Two that I'm aware of. Uh-huh. And, um, and Father's Day is just around the corner, so who better to suggest some Father's Day gift ideas than us? These guys. And see, here's the thing. We don't need expensive gifts, so our list is going to be things under 50 bucks. Right. That's going to happen on this episode of Men Are So Smart. <laughs> Men Are So Smart, I'm Lou Gallagher. I'm Corbett Ronnie. Hey, Ronnie, today uh, we're going to be talking about Father's Day and some gift ideas. You know, it's fast approaching on Sunday, the 16th yeah. of June. And if you, Skippy, are looking for an affordable gift... Uh, you've come to the right spot. Men are so smart, got their finger on the pulse of Father Day gifts. Here's a quick roundup of some relatively inexpensive items we think dads will appreciate. These products and services are independently chosen and we are not being reimbursed, reimbursed or whatever. Uh, what's the word? <laughs> or disimbursed. Yeah, we, you know, <laughs> we're, we're not getting paid for this crap. That's right. what I'm saying, okay? Yeah. All right, so Ronnie, let's talk about the first one. All right, this first one is the JBL Clip 3. Oh, that's kind of cool. Let's yeah. see how that works. Now, I have a couple of these, and I love them. They're okay. great. Uh, this one, though, just what every dad needs, a micro wireless speaker to play his jams on. I got jams, That's still. my jam. Not only does this fully waterproof Bluetooth speaker uh, have improved battery life and better sound than the Clip 2, it's also more durable thanks to the integrated carabiner acting as a bumper around the entire perimeter of the speaker. It's one of the top speakers for its tiny size. How much? It costs just $40. Holy cow, that's affordable? Yeah, that is. And they are great. I have one. Boy, it's it's smaller than a pack of cards. Okay. And it, it really throws out the sound. Huh. And then I have another big one. I don't know. It's got to be eight inches long. Right. That thing booms. Well, speaking so, of, I have a boom box. Does that count? Uh, <laughs> yes. This one you plug an 8-track into. <laughs> I want to say it's old. <laughs> it's All right, old. Uh, next up. And you know what? At the end of this episode or at the end of this article we're sharing with you, we're going to give you some things that we might like that we think you might as well. Okay, yep. so stand by for that. Next up is the Tribit X-Sound Go. Go. I am. Okay. There's Go. a picture of it right there for you. Another candidate for best value wireless speaker, the Tribit X-Sound Go is one of the best ones for the money, about 32 bucks at Amazon, depending on which color you choose. I don't know how that should affect it. <laughs> <laughs> the, oh, the blue one's more than the red. Oh, of course. Yeah, of course it is. And if you're willing to spend a little more, around $55, you can pick up the larger Max Sound Plus, Ooh. which has richer sound and more bass. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, that, that that I can I can hear the difference. Did you feel it? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. This next one, now, they're earbuds, and I don't know if you have a pair. I don't, Ronnie. You know, I well, I do, but they're the wire ones still. I, okay. I, I, so which tell are, me, I don't get this. Which are fine. Right. These these earbuds, they're amazing. Okay. Uh, this set is by Tautronics. Uh -huh. They're called True Wireless Earbuds. They're forty five dollars. Uh, if you're not ready to splurge on a pair of Apple AirPods which are like $140 plus tax. Uh -huh. I bought in two sets of them so far. Uh, or otherwise fairly pricey, totally wireless earphones. There are some affordable options out there, including Tautronics True Wireless Earbuds. Uh, they're pretty decent. They may not deliver the stellar sound quality. The AirPods, oh, excuse me, it says the AirPods don't either. Mm, I disagree a little bit. Hmm. Uh, but they are plenty decent. Uh, they, they have Bluetooth 5.0 and offer five hours of battery life at moderate volume letter, le levels. And they're also sweat proof so dad can use them at the gym. And that really is where these things shine is, man, at the gym, because I hate having wires around me when I'm on the elliptical or whatever, yeah. they get tangled and everything. Mm -hmm. these, uh, these earbuds are amazing. Well, you know, I'm... Uh, You're at the gym so often. Well, I call the bathroom the gym. <laughs> now I can say, hey, I went to the gym this morning. <laughs> I've gone twice to the gym today. 
Happy Father's Day. That's a Happy Father's Day joke right there. All right, next up on our list is the Coast HP7 LED flashlight. You know, these are great gifts. This is a great gift right here. Remember when we had um, Matt and Tisha into the radio station uh, as our special yes. guests? Yep. Um, they brought me a gift, which was a really cool flashlight that has about five different functions. I think I showed it to you. Yes. Even a red flashing light for emergencies. This one uh, is is under 50 bucks. The Coast HP7 is one of the better ones that have been tested. Relatively compact and rated at 530 lumens. It's very bright for its size. It, I just sounded like I was from the, it's very bright for its size. <laughs> And has a slide focus that allows you to shape the beam from flood to spot. That's kind of cool. Yeah. Uh, and then lock the beam into whatever shape you choose. Its list price is 60 bucks, but you can get it for less than 40 It's powered by four AAA batteries, which come included. And once again, um, list price 60 bucks. Now, I'll tell you, I keep a little flashlight right on my nightstand because if I have to get up and go to the bathroom in the middle of the night... Mm -hmm. You never know where the dogs are going to be laying. Right. And so I have stepped on and or tripped over dogs before. So now I get up. I just make sure that my path between the bed and the bathroom is clear. Off I go. Uh, this next one. Oh, man. Have I used these a lot? Uh, Xsense Portable Charger. 10,000 milliamp hour. Uh, this starts at just $26. Although it's not incredibly personal... No, not necessarily. No one's going to be upset with a portable battery pack as a gift, especially one that's among the smallest and lightest with 18 PD, which is power delivery, and Quick Charge 3.0 for devices that support it. Uh, this one has both a USC. I'm I went sorry. to school there two years. <laughs> University of Southern Carmichael? Yeah, well, actually, yeah. I drove by it for two years. <laughs> It's USC C port and a USB A port, and can be used with both Android and Apple smartphones. Uh, though no cables are included, certain colors cost as low as twenty six dollars. Pink. <laughs> I had uh, when I went to SEMA a couple years ago. I had a uh, i an iPhone six, and the battery would last about two hours. Yeah, tops. The problem was, boy, do I know that SEMA is so gigantic. If you don't have a phone, you're never ever going to be able to hook up with your people again. Oh yeah, you get separated. It's ginormous. So I had to keep. I had two of these. I had to keep my phone on one of these at all times during the day. Very inconvenient. But with these batteries, it's like, eh, no big deal. Mm. Dads would love it. Yeah. Um, if you've got a techie dad. Uh, or tacky dad for that matter. <laughs> a Mophi Power Station mini battery pack. Um, you can get two of these for $35. Dang. The Mophi is a very slim. Uh, they should have chose Mofo. That, uh, Mofo <laughs> would be the, yeah, that's the, what okay, I would call it. You know what? We're going to rename it. Just <laughs> don't Mofo. search for this. <laughs> don't search for the Mofo Power Station this mini. This is Mofo, Mofo Mini. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm totally confused. Uh, it's slick looking. It's a charging brick that houses 3,000 milliamp battery hours, which should fully charge up most phones. No cable included. But you can get these, as I said, in a two-pack on Amazon for as little as 35 bucks. Huh. Only the blue version is available at that price, but it does come in other color options. Why in the hell would the color... Influence the price. Uh, Crips have more money than Bloods do. So okay, Ronnie, you yeah. would know. <laughs> <laughs> they they sling them out dope. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this next one, I I have one of these and I use it every morning. Not this exact one. This one is the Eufy Smart Scale P1, and okay. it's about forty five dollars. All right. Uh, just what every dad needs, a smart scale, and the Eufy P1 is one of the more affordable models at around $45. Beyond weight, you can track body fat, BMI, bone mass, muscle mass, and more for multiple users. Ooh, that would be handy. Uh, you track everything using the Eufy Life app, but the scale also ties into Apple Health. Oh, wow, I think I have to get one of these. Okay. Uh, Apple Health, Google Fit, and the Fitbit app. 
Dang. I. This is what I'm asking for right here. Okay, see, now look. Yep. That's what we do. Because we're givers. Vicky. We, yeah, hello. Uh, Yuffie. Yeah, Yuffie you're, Smart Scale, E U F Y. Instead of just listening to the show, Viki. Uh, <laughs> user Viki. <laughs> user Viki. You need to watch right now because I'm showing the picture of what this thing is and you need to get that. That's what right? I want. Okay, because that's what I do. I'm, I'm a giver. <laughs> you are a giver. I am a giver. Next up, the BioLite Power Light Mini Wearable Light and Power Bank. Uh, this $40 BioLite Power Light Mini is a handy lantern, bike light and charger all in one. You clip it to a pocket or strap or mount it onto your bike. It comes with a mount, by the way, and has a huge USB rechargeable battery providing up to 52 hours of light. It can also give your phone a backup boost. Lighting modes include white lantern, red night vision, red and white strobe. Oh, that'd be cool. Oh, dang. For the band. Yeah. <laughs> and white point light. Oh, that's, that's Andy. It's a great choice for eco-minded folks who enjoy camping. What's that? Uh, I'll explain it to you later. It's kind of complicated. Camping or outdoor activities? Yeah, again. Where people go outside? Oh, dang. There was a big old bug. Oh, that, are we camping now? <laughs> Is that what happens? That's pretty much what happens during camping. <laughs> I don't like it. I'm not camping anymore. <laughs> anyway, 40 bucks. Uh, you'll, you'll love it. Dad will love it. Yes, hopefully. Uh, these next ones, now these could be kind of handy if you tend to look at your iPad or your iPhone in bed at night. Okay. They're the Gunner Optics Blue Light Blocking Glasses. All right. And they started at about $36. Oh, for your screen. Yes. Yeah, okay. Uh, for several years, Gunner Optics has been making computer glasses designed to block blue light and help alleviate the eye strain that you get from staring at displays for long periods. Uh, the glasses come in a variety of styles and a few different tints. The core models have an amber lens, anti-reflective coatings, and slight magnification. No, oh, I would like that. Uh, the Vertex, pictured here in both amber and clear tents, Riot and Intercept are all priced at less than $50. You can even add prescription lenses through the Gunner website, huh. uh, but those obviously cost a little bit more. And I'll tell you, they have done some studies, and if you typically look at your iPad or iPhone in bed, that tends to keep your brain spinning a little bit. It makes it harder to sleep. Makes it harder to fall asleep. So... This might be a great gift. You know, my problem is not really the falling asleep, it's the staying asleep. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, all right, I'll tell you what. Let's just quickly, uh, the Roku streaming stick, you can get that for Dad. Excellent video streamer, cost around 50 bucks. The Google Home Mini, Ronnie. Yep. Uh, also $49 or less. Uh -huh. The Echo Dot is $50. Uh -huh. uh, this Logitech keyboard, if you this have... This is like cool. A, I think I like this For an right iPad, there. it's a little bit more mm -hmm. easier to use than the uh, the little pad that they give you. And this is the one that Lou needs. The Logitech MX Anywhere 2S wireless mouse. I need that. Yep. I it's, need it. And it's only 30 bucks. Or, oh, 50 bucks. That was 50 Okay. Yeah, but... It probably, uh, I would imagine, to just side side scrolling too. Yeah. Okay. So. so, all right. So now Father's Day weekend coming up. Yeah. And or, as they call it in Oakland, most confusing day of the year. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where I live, the Gallagher compound, in my neighborhood, it's so busy. <laughs> <laughs> How busy is it? I'll tell you how busy it is. <laughs> they got a guy that parks cars, okay? <laughs> they got valet service. Valet service yeah. in the neighborhood on Father's That's Day. Convenient. Yeah, That's okay, convenient. Yeah, okay, so uh, here's here's my thoughts on Father's Day. I really don't need anything. I, you know, the mouse or something, that's really thoughtful. But for me, here's all I hope for. One, I'd like to have a cigar. Right. Two, I think I'd like to have a small bottle of tequila. Uh, and three, I just want my kids to be there. Yeah. And my grandkids, of course. And, and a NASCAR race. Oh, that would be awesome. It's interesting, too, you know, as long as we've been uh, NASCAR fans, you know, they don't race on Mother's Day. <laughs> they don't. They never have. They never will. Right. But on Father's Day. That's a little different. Yeah, story. yeah. Bring it yeah. on. Yep. And I'll watch anything. 
that races on four wheels. Yes. It doesn't matter. Yep. <laughs> when I Shopping used, carts, whatever. <laughs> when I used to be the uh, racetrack announcer at the local NASCAR Speedway here, um, I used to, um, oh shoot, I, 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 what was I saying? Well, you you told me one time about the uh, the trailer races. Oh yeah. Oh, those are like fun. And then also when they throw the soap on the track. The enduro races. Oh god dang. Those are terrific. Those would be a kick in the pants. All right, I forgot what I was going to say. I was, oh well. I was looking ahead. So Ronnie, what is it that besides what you saw on our list today? Um, you know what? I really, again, kind of the same thing. I would like my kids to be here. I'm not so sure my daughter will be able to make it up. Um, but yeah, go out to dinner. We'll probably go out with my, my father-in-law or my in-laws uh, to dinner somewhere. And uh, yeah, you know, that's spending time with family and just relaxing. We don't need much. Yeah, no. yeah, I'll tell you the truth. Save your money. Don't get a card. Hey, don't honestly, card. yeah, oh, yeah, I don't need a card. Cards yeah. are... Cards are not that great for me. And get Dad a 12-pack. Get him a case of beer if he likes beer. Get yeah. him a case of his favorite beer. Yeah. That's what Dad's like. They don't need any sentimental... How about this? How about mowing the lawn for him and picking up the after the dog in the backyard? Yeah. Doing that. Wash his car. Oh. That would be a nice thing to if do. If only. Yeah. Yep. Okay, well, look. You know what? Being a father is probably the best job that I've ever had. And, um, the pay is not great. It's not. No. <laughs> and the residuals just aren't there. <laughs> there. Yeah, it's not. I'm not sure it's worth it in the long run. I don't know. <laughs> you know what? Screw it. <laughs> Forget about it. Uh, anyway, Father's Day, we hope that uh, you'll take care of Dad. And, you know, I, I got to say that I, uh, and I don't want to bring the whole room down, but my dad's been gone for quite a few years now. Mine too. Yeah. A lot of years. Um, but you don't realize until you get older that you really kind of miss your dad, you know, and there are times when you wish you could go to him with a problem or a question or something yep. like that. And so what I'm saying is if you have a beef with your dad right now and he's still alive, screw it up, mend that fence. Yeah. You know what? Mend that fence because when you get to be older, you're going to regret that. And you're going to regret looking at an empty rocking chair. Well, and I will tell you this, men completely different than women, in that when women have to get advice from someone, even if mom isn't around, they turn to other women. Guys don't do that. No. We're not we're not reaching out to other men for men for manly advice. You know, that reminds me too of another thing. My wife will uh, say to me when I come home from your house uh, shooting the show. So what did you, you and Ronnie talk about when we did our show? Oh, well, how's Vicky? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Are they going to Are they going to Tahoe next weekend? I don't know. Yeah. And she says to me, don't you ask any questions? <laughs> no, I'm my a wife, man. My wife does the same exact thing. Yeah. I go to lunch with the buddy right. of mine. What's her slept to? Yeah. I don't know. Her name didn't come up? Never came up. <laughs> yeah. She's a school teacher. She's about done with school. Yeah. That's all I know. <laughs> all right. So, honor thy father. Yep. And thy mother, really. Um, <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe. We appreciate you watching. <laughs> we hope you got some ideas from our show today. Uh, we'll list a link uh, to the story so that you can see some of these items. Yeah. If you're interested. And uh, we'll do that. So, like the show, uh, subscribe to our channel. Yep. When you do, click the bell. That way you get notifications each time a new show comes out. Don't just click it. Crush it. Oh, yeah. Crush it. For sure. Yeah. And um, when do our shows come out? Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, 6 a.m. specific. Yeah. 6 a.m. specific time. <laughs> 9, 9 a.m. Eastern time. Right. All right, that'll do it for us. I'm Lou Gallagher. I'm Corvette Ronnie. Happy Father's Day to all you dads from both.